greetings everyone thank you sir thank you so i will share my screen thank you for the opportunity so in level 1 we did learn about chatting with chat gpt basic prompts it is a natural language processing you do not need any coding background anything as you talk to a friend you talk with chat gpt right i have already showed you this in the previous uh, hackathons and it is very simple i have already told in the natural language right in the second stage i showed you about playing with templates i have made excel templates this and that and very easy to make right so templates i showed you about powerpoint tally excel okay now discussing about the usability in short it was a effortless creation it was personalized and it was time saving effortless because we did not have to do anything simple talking to chat gpt like a friend and it was done right personalized nature because it was as per our needs our own specific needs jaisa aapko chahiye waisa banaya usko right and the third important point is very very simple it was time saving 100% lots and lots of 2 hours and 3 hours of work could be done in less and less time right so what i am going to show you today it is intelligent automation we all believe as sir said we are afraid to that uh, technology bahut heavy hai kaise adopt kare how we will adopt and uh, it will cost us lakhs and everything but let me tell you once again i will show you the tools we can do automation in data analysis task automation personalization what i am going to choose is one simple task automation very very simple right the biggest question is how everybody thinks technology adopt karna hai but they get stuck is how regularly i have been telling that uh, today we are to, going to use power query right i'll show you everything step by step and regularly whether is my seminar webinar my classes my channel every where i'm telling it is very easy right so the presentation is almost done and now what are we waiting for let's go right now i am going to show you from the stage my excel is visible please anyone can confirm yeah visible yes. so power query power query is not a different app you do not have to download anything no need to go anywhere you have to just go to microsoft excel right so how you can access power query we do go to data okay and get data i hope this is visible get data and you can see there are hundreds of sources from file you can extract data from excel text xml json whatever it is there are hundreds of sources what i am going to show is from a folder right breaking the surprise i want to show you that we will update gsp return in a folder and our excel will get updated such level of automation you don't have to do anything just keep the file in the folder and we will show i will show you how our excel will automatically get automatically get updated right so in this folder my this folder is visible i think i have just copied the location of the folder and nothing else okay and pasted here simple i click on open now the power query window will come automatically no need to click any app nothing just get data and your power query is there so here since we have to do little bit customization i go to transform data we can combine load anything but we first need to transform the data as per our requirement right so transform data this is the power query screen and we can see that one minute it is getting loaded there are two files right now in my folder i will show you there are two files gstr04 uh, and 05 april and may very simple this what we do is we just leave it as it is and here we can see the option combine files so i have come because we need a combination of one by one i will show you that as soon as i update the return in the folder our excel will get updated so here we are it is taking some time and this is the window right so here in power query everything is stable right so the gst return we can see if i click on one table suppose this is the year column if i click here in the next this will be another 
so we choose i have taken the use case of itc it is in table number 10 right we can see i will show you details uh, itc we all know other than reverse charge then it is showing the reverse charge rate. okay i have just selected the table and clicked on okay from both the files i have showed you that there are two files in the folder april and May. so it will automatically evaluate the query and everything right little bit just uh, i know it is taking time but it's already done even if i stop here and do nothing okay i just i have loaded in the power query and i click on close and load okay you just see one thing i'll show in step by step process i have simply update uploaded in power query and i have given close and load not done a single anything except merging files now you see you can see a fourth fourth month is here one minute and you can see there is description integrated text everything first i will copy and show you suppose in this new folder i will copy sixth month okay so sixth month you can see it is copied here and simple refresh refresh is not always fi you have to go to query and refresh and you can see that sixth month has already come here every single thing of that itc part not the entire gst you can choose sales you can choose purchase you can choose itc cash pay as per your wish i told you automation and all is personalized right now once again i will show you that how more specific how can it be done i just delete this file okay not an issue and again i will show you that as soon as you delete it will go away this is little bit slow and you see live automation right now i will show you little bit how to edit it so we go to query again and go to edit in the itc part there is reverse charge and there is other than reverse charge for example i just want other than reverse charge so what i can do is we all have seen gst return first part is text paid to icc i don't need this line right little bit of this uh, amendment you have to do so remove the top row remove the top row okay so it will ask me which row how many rows to remove i'll write one okay and then the headings come up description total text table integrated central state all this then i want that last two minutes left yeah okay first uh, this first row has become the this is the header of the table now what i want is only the other than reverse charge part so one two three four five in the sixth row i can see there is reverse charge what i will do is remove alternate row and i will write first row to remove is row number six number of rows to remove is seven okay you can uh, i do this little side one minute and you can see that one two three four five six seven and then again other than reverse charge card so i type here seven and then how many rows i need one two three four five simple fine okay and you see both the returns i have taken two returns this is there and simple close and load okay now only the reverse charge other than reverse charge part will come and now once again i will show you i will copy one return one your pen or 15 how much you want i have just simply copied here and once again i click on refresh and you can see it is done selected part not everything so for your clients you don't uh, suppose you want the sales data of every gs return just copy your gs return and sales will be filtered out you don't have to go to pdf check how much sales you have a month or anything cash paid itc or whatever whatever you want specific portion of the pdf not only gst return any return which is of common nature we know gst april and may are both same except for the figure their format is same this automates the format reading the format is this part all this was under power query extract transform and load we have extracted from the PDF whatever we needed, we have transformed it and then simply loaded in the Excel file. Very, very easy. Now, if this someone is saying hard, I don't know what you want, but AI implementation is really this easy and really automated and really thank can you, save sir. your time. Thank you. That's all from my side. Yeah. Thank you, Lokesh, for your uh, demo of your query. Congratulations to you. You can relax now. You have given intelligent automation from Power Query, Power Query to GSTR 3B, PDF, PDF to Excel. So this can be used by our members for uh, their GST practice and they can do it 
whatever they want. Now the forum is open for our uh, juries. Over to you, Manu sir. Thank you, Kumesh bhai. Um, Lokesh ji, uh, excellent presentation. Thank I think you. you made things very simple uh, and you showed the Power Query. But one small question which I have is that this is basically a feature of Power Query. You've not used any AI in this, I believe. Sir, Power Query is completely artificial intelligence, sir. Not only this, everything that Excel cannot do. Suppose you have to remove rows and uh, suppose uh, a part of this Excel requires formula. But in Power Query, you do not, it automatically calculates everything. The OT feature, Excel is introduced now, but this reads this reads through artificial intelligence only, sir. If you suppose there are different different lines and you have to extract a part of the line, then in Excel it is very difficult. But in Power Query, using its feature, these are all artificial feature, artificial intelligent features, sir. It from a PDF, it is extracting whatever you are telling it. So this is intelligence, sir. How we can say that this is not intelligence? It is using its intelligence as per your commands okay can we thank you thank you nice presentation uh, can we integrate these features along in, in tally also during the course of output file creation yes sir yes can you elaborate it how it is possible in tally i do not work so much but that they is the data sources i have already told there are 100 plus data sources so from every data which is it is extracting the output file is already linked, sir. I showed you that folder. Okay. We are changing the folder and Excel file. So uh, definitely there, there will be options, sir. All the data sources are interlinked. As a follow-up question, so, so how, how comfortable the members will be in using Power Query as a tool in addition to Excel? Can you just throw light on it on this aspect? So so we need to understand the Adoption of this usage, okay? Solution which you have created for the members. Yeah. Only one thing I can say, Power Query is more, maybe 10, 15 times powerful than Excel. Normally when we get PDF, what we do, we scan, and uh, suppose we get the client's uh, statements and all. What we do, we go tick, 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 taking out the uh, this uh, PDFs and matching it manually. But once they learn Power Query, which is a part of Excel, you don't have to install anything, you don't have to do anything. In PDF reading, it is such a wonderful tool that it translates everything. We need 26 AS, we need GSTR, and many PDFs we are working with. Client statements, everything, bank statements. So this extracts relevant parts. Not You don't have to read the full PDF, nothing. If it is in your supposed repeated formats, extract the relevant parts, and it is so easy. You just have insert, except, sorry, X. You don't have to go to insert, but go to data, and your Power Query is ready. So you, it is very easy, sir. I mean, once they know the possibilities, it becomes endless. Unless you don't know it, like I cannot say, but once you learn it, this is my objective that you should know that Power Query is such a wonderful tool and such easy. And data extraction and loading and manipulation, all this part, unclean data. Nowadays, we talk about that we need to clean the data. Such functions in Power Query, such artificial intelligent functions, that it does it wonderfully, saving our lot of time, especially working with PDFs and other files, merging them, and uh, all this that there are complications in Excel, but in Power Query, I showed you that I have merged two PDFs, right? It is such a complete, if I tell that you would merge two, two GSTR 3D. Oh, no, we got it. We, it. we got it, your estimation. Thank you.